hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel i hope you guys are doing great so in this video i'm going to talk about how you can create realistic glass texture in blender so without any further delay now let's get started the tutorial so here you can see guys here we have one glass material which is look fine but if i'm just going to show my second slot so here you can see that look much realistic -er rather than this one so here you can see how you can create that kind of realistic grass material in blender you need to do little setting and which setting you have to do i'm just going to talk about in this video so make sure you watch the tutorial till end and uh, first of all we'll just create a glass material then we'll uh, we'll show that trick which is give you the realistic glass material that look fine but here you can see that is look more realistic so how you can do this let's start it so first of all, I just want to delete my cube from here. I'm just going to move my viewport shading mode and here I'm just going to add one sphere and I'm just going to little scale it and then I'm just going to add subdivision surface modifier and going to little smooth as well. Okay, and after that, I'm just going to my material section and here I'm just going to create a new material and after that, make sure that uh, base color is totally white. Okay, that hexagon should be triple F, triple F, something like that. That is the white color basically. And you have to just scroll it down, and from here, you have to just increase this transmission value to one. Okay, so it will look like this. You have to just do it one. And after that, you have to just decrease the uh, roughness value to zero. So it will look like this. And after that, you have to just go to your IR setting. It's called index of reflection basically. So I'm just want to set this as a 1.7. That's look fine by the way. Yeah, yeah, that's look fine. And after that, you have to scroll it up. And from here, you can see the preview as well. And here you can see that's it. That's look fine by the way. So I just want to switch my rendering mode from here to here. So here you can see guys. Here we have a perfect glass texture. But uh, there is one problem. If I'm just going to take a render. So here I'm just going to take a render first of all. So here you can see that looks something like that okay so that's look fine but it's not look exactly what we want so for that what we have to do we have to do just little setting so first of all i just want to change my slot so we can see the difference by the way so this is a slot 2 by the way and i just want to move into a slot 5 and then i'm just going to my render properties and here i'm just going to increase this transparent glass option and when i'm just going to turn on this transparent glass so here you can see that's the magic which is i'm talking about by the way and now if i will just take the render so here you can see you will get the that is totally transparent glass if you place any object behind it so you can literally see that object as well okay so that is the trick which is i thought i should share with you so here you can see this is the after and this is the before by the way so there is a lots of difference between it and so that's how you can create that kind of realistic glass in blender and that is very cool trick and that is very cool option which is i thought i should share with you so i hope you like this video so thanks for watching this video guys if you learn something in this video please hit the like button hit the share button and subscribe my channel also if you have any queries if you have a session please let me know in the comment box i will definitely reply comment so bye bye take care and stay home guys